Whoa. Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel. And now we are in Pigeon Forge. Taylor's gonna take the camera over. Uh, but we are in Pigeon Forge. So tonight we're gonna go to Dollywood and we're gonna see the Aluminum Knights. I think that's how it's pronounced. Uh, but we're gonna go there. But right now we're at the Apple Barn and we had breakfast at the Old Mill. And we have our little doggy with us, Zoe. So we have basically been getting our food to go. And so, because we can't take her inside, obviously. But yeah, right now we're at the Apple Barn. We're just walking around. And then I think we're gonna get lunch at a place that Taylor's really excited for because he gets his barbecue nachos. Barbecue pork. Was it pulled pork? Pulled pork nachos. Yes. So he's really excited about that. Hopefully they still have that place. Um, but I got a little cider. It's very sweet. Um, so where I'm from Lexington, we have a place called Wisebird, and that's where I usually get cider from. And it's not as sweet there, but it, Taylor made a really good point that maybe it's because of it being like fresh apples. Um, that could be what's making it real sweet. But I get to keep this cute little glass. This entire thing was $8, which is not bad, because I get to keep the glass. Um, so yeah, we're gonna walk around, go to the Christmas store, because I'm very excited for Christmas. And then maybe get like an apple pie or something. Come on, come on. Oh my goodness, aren't you just so cute? Look at her! <laughs> Literally stealing the show. <laughs> she hasn't quite figured out one side or the other. <laughs> She's still learning. It's Christmas Village, guys. That one's so cute. It's like being a bar humbug, honey. And oh, let me, let me keep my truck. This cute, we found this cute little one right here. We're gonna get Caitlin and Taylor on it. And then we got this one for it being our first year married, first Christmas. So that'll be really cute. And then Taylor found his section. Boo. Boo. Yes. The den mother. Oh, the dog. <laughs> okay, so we went into the Christmas shop. We got some ornaments. They were basically both for, well, I actually showed it in the store, but we got them for Christmas, uh, for our first year being married. And then we got the Mickey truck. Zoe's living her best life with her den mother. Literally him. Mm. Now we're at the island. Got Zoe. She's very famous. Uh, but we're gonna go eat these barbecue nachos that Taylor has been literally craving and talking about since we've been here in 2019, maybe? 2019. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Okay guys, Taylor told me he's ready to ride the Ferris wheel. He's wanting to overcome his fear of heights. You're dreaming. <laughs> you can ride in the baseball one. Me and Bird are kind of the same. Okay guys, I'm having a panic attack. There's so many. It's 
So we're staying at the Home Tree Suite, which is actually right across the road from the island, which it looks very far from there, but there's an entrance right down this way. So we literally go straight across and we're right in at the island. So that's very convenient. And then this hotel actually allows dogs. I think there's one floor that's just designated for them. So we brought our little doggy. And then this is, and this morning is the first time we've actually seen other dogs. Okay, we made it into, well, we're about to make it into Dollywood. The tram just dropped us off. And now we're walking up to have our tickets scanned. So he's in Doggywood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So the entrance is over there, and then doggy wood where you can take your dogs is right here. Doggy wood. Are you ready? They're both open on the end. It's a little cottage. We love you. We love you, Zoe. We got a little fireplace. finally rode his first big boy ride and how do you feel like I'm never doing it again <laughs> I was shocked but now that you've done this you can't say that you can't do anything at Disney because the slinky ride is nothing I still ain't doing Mount Everest no okay I don't expect that one but the slinky one you definitely can do because it is a baby ride compared to that and we we weren't able to film. We weren't able to film on that ride. So no, no, no. Hold on again. Yeah, there was like no chance that someone could actually film on that. Now we're walking to get dinner. And it's getting almost dark outside. So some of the lights will start coming on in a little bit, but they'll definitely be on by the time we finish dinner. So some of the lights are already on. Looks like they're starting to turn on the lights on. Back. Bye. He's gonna go check on the bread. Mom's over here looking at really big pumpkins. So I have to get a hoodie because I'm cold. <laughs> oh, it is magical. <laughs> So we're towards the back of the park. We're about to walk it to the part where the Luminites are. Luminites. Luminites. Is it Luminites? Yes. Yes. And you can see the eagle from here, which we will never ride because none of us can handle that. We had dinner to Aunt Granny's and it was good. It used to be a buffet and then they changed it to um, like you got to pick four different entrees or like four different meats I guess I should say and then you picked or no I'm sorry you picked three different meats and then you picked four different sides and I think they started doing that because of COVID. This is Hoot Owl. Hoot Owl? Yeah. Hoot Owl Hollow. Oh my god, I 
guitar over here. So, are those owls? I guess. <laughs> I think they're owls. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, I think they're owls. They kind of look like ghosts. Wow. Ghost owls. These are my favorite, because they got squirrels. Squirrel. Who's our favorite squirrel? Gammy. Gammy. They have firework pumpkins for the ride that's here. I can't remember what the name of it is, but it's something to do with like firefighters. Fire station. Fire station, something like that. I've rode this before, but it's been a really long time. This is the chillin' pumpkin. This is more for the firehouse ride up there. So this theme down this way must be bats. They have the frogs in the water. Taylor's riding this. You don't want to ride? You don't want to ride that? No. Put me six feet deep. We're going into a different dimension. Ooh. Apple Barn. Wait, yeah. I'm getting confused because the restaurant's called Applewood, but the whole place is considered the Apple Barn. Um, and so we get the Apple Barn juice, which I've actually made the Apple Barn juice before, and I take it places. Like we actually had it at our um, bridal shower, or I guess my bridal shower, and everybody loved it. So this is where we got the idea. This is the original juice is from here. What is it? Taylor. This is convenient. This is more convenient than the old mill. <laughs> we got our food. 
the Guffy apple julep juice and then we're sitting right outside. So if you don't want to wait, just get it to go. And they do give you the fritters. So that was something we were kind of concerned if we were going to get those. But you do have to order the juice or they won't give you that, I don't think. But we just ordered it. So yeah, great idea if you have a dog or if you don't want to wait. Okay guys, we're these type of people, but not these type of people. <laughs> like this is cute, and then this is just cringy. cringy, yeah. You know what's worse than that? This. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm happy. It's like a village. Oh wait, this is the village that the lady was talking about. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh, wow. I need the gingerbread man. That's cute. You know where I know I'm overwhelmed with joy. No, I really don't. Look at this. Cute. Young me was obsessed with trains. This one would have been my favorite. This is literally this place right here, the Christmas shop. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, it's kind of creepy. We don't have something. Well, mom has something, but we don't. Have something. Mm -hmm. We need to get some. Now, why can't we create something like this? Why do we always suck? What do you mean? When we create our gingerbread houses. Uh, yeah, we're really bad at them. They always fall apart. Last year, or the year before we bought it, where they were already pre-made. I think it was last year. Yeah, those were good. Just because they were already made. This is the same room that we got yesterday with the truck. Oh, It's no. all the same stuff. The we figured out, guys, it's named Jim Shore. Cute. They're not too, I mean, they're expensive, but they're not, oh, wow. That's really expensive. They're good gifts if you like So this is the one we got yesterday. And they have all the Disney ones over here. They have Mickey and Minnie. This one's cute. I like this one with them being dressed like Santa. Okay, then you want to spend $700 on a moose? Oh, wow. Maybe one day. What mom doesn't know is that we bought this tree for the house. Going back into Christmas Village. He's made it, everybody.
I get the moose tracks and it is basically like Rocky Road um, but it's a vanilla ice cream and then they put like caramel and chocolate pieces in it oh it's so good 